and shifting our focus to mm. India after a highly successful 2023 the Indian Space Agency or ISRO is geared up for its maiden launch of this new year India's PSLV C58 mission is all set to launch at the X-ray polarimeter satellite or Expo Saturday the mission is the first dedicated polarimetry mission of the nation the Expo Sat mission will try to unravel the mysteries of black holes well, ExpoSat will launch into an eastward low inclination orbit at 9.10 a.m. local time today. The satellite will be launched from the Satish Dhawan Space Center located in Sri Harikota in the state of Andhra Pradesh. The mission will be studying the 50 brightest known sources in the universe. The new satellite seeks to understand the intricacies of bright celestial X-ray sources. This by examining their complicated dynamics under harsh circumstances. Now, the ExpoSat spacecraft is carrying cutting-edge technology, which is designed particularly for low Earth orbit exploration. The satellite's configuration is adapted from the IMS-2 bus, bus platform but with the mainframe systems drawing from the heritage of IRS satellites. According to ISRO, the mission life stands to about five to have about five years exposat carries two primary payloads here polyx which is a polarimeter instrument that helps in taking x-rays and the second payload is x spect which studies the x-rays and timing in space now in layman terms a payload refers to the valuable cargo a spacecraft carries like satellites scientific instruments or equipment it's something that we send to space for specific purposes, whether it's communication, exploration or research. Let's now delve deeper into the specifications of these payloads, starting with Polex. The payload will help uh, measuring polarization of X-rays in the energy band, originating from approximately 50 potential cosmic sources. Now, to achieve these polarization measurements, the payload will employ the Thomson scattering technology. Now, Thomson scattering is like sunlight bouncing off a mirror. It helps one to understand how X-rays behave by looking at how they scatter or bounce off other particles in space. Now, moving on to the second payload, we're talking about X-SPECT. It will conduct a long-term spectral and temporal study of cosmic X-ray sources in the set energy band. The payload will focus on analyzing X-ray emissions from different cosmic sources. For more details on this, our correspondent Siddharth MP brings us this report. A listen in. On New Year's Day, ISRO is all set for its maiden launch mission of the new year 2024. This mission is known as PSLV C-58 ExpoSat. Essentially, this is meant to study X-rays that are originating from space. Basically, X-rays are very powerful sources, extremely powerful sources of light. So there are many natural phenomena in space from where X-rays are emitted. So what happens is when these X-rays are emitted, they also carry information uh, along with these X-rays on what causes them, where it's caused from and the kind of intensity of these events typically x-rays are caused by black holes and neutron stars but you know these are also phenomena that are not easy to study because of the fact that when x-rays are emitted the earth's atmosphere does not permit these x-rays to enter the earth so the best option to study x-rays is to launch a satellite to space put it around the earth in orbit and then from there when the x-rays travel through space you study them from there that's the idea of x-ray polarimetry satellite or exposat which is rose launching the launch is at 9 10 a.m the countdown is underway it's a 25 hour long countdown which started on sunday at 8 10 a.m 9 10 is the launch what we have to remember is that this countdown is a crucial technical process it's at this time that the liquid fuels of the rocket are filled and various systems and subsystems of the rocket are also tested by computers to ensure that everything is fine and to ensure that it's all safe to go ahead with the launch from Sri Harikota Satish Dhawan Space Center Siddharth MP we on world is one